Okay, we're taking a look at a man pack. I actually referred to it as a man purse on my YouTube channel in a previous video and got chastised for it. Can't call it a purse. Uh, the ultimate EDC kit, let's call it that. So here we go. We've got a heavy duty multi tool. This is a Leatherman variety. And I have several multi tools, but this is the one that's on the pack because I also have on the other sheath, on the other side, the matching sheath, I have the accessories that go along with it that make that tool particularly versatile. So different saw inserts and different like wrenches and different tools that, that go with the Leatherman. So you can research that and find out more details on that. There's a flashlight on the top, which I'll show you later, that is attached to the carry handle on the top. On the front, we've got a, you see a leak uh, uh, knife right there. It's made in the United States of America. I have a Fisher Space Pen that clips on there nice and tight, nice and snug, nice clip on there. That's the original Space Pen. That, of course, is also made in the USA. Then I've got a titanium pry bar there, a, 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 well, like a mini tool. And I've got another titanium pry bar inside that you'll see later. <clears throat> but there's like a, a little little tool that's made of titanium. And of course, it's a Maxpedition bag, so those zippers and the pulls and so forth are all very heavy duty, so you don't have to worry about those messing up on you. Inside, you can see a spork there, and you can see some uh, surgical gloves. I have a waterproof container there with some uh, matches in it and fire starting uh, items. I've got some uh, cord there, some hemp cord and, a, and some paracord on that side. And then I've got a couple of handkerchiefs. And then I have a whole nother Maxpedition organizer inside. <clears throat> and we'll take a look real quick at what's inside that. And I'm not inventorying everything here. I'm just giving you a quick look at the bag. There's a lot of videos out on specific items and so forth, so I'm not going to go into huge detail here. But you can see inside, I've got a bunch of items in here, a little water filtration system. I've got that uh, titanium pry bar in there, some scissors, some nail cutters. I've got a bunch of extra little flashlights. One of them is a little 4.7 CR123 powered, very powerful flashlight, and I've got an extra CR123 battery there. Those all have very long shelf lives. I have some, a couple of... Um, uh, lithium ion batteries there, some extra cordage, just a, a, a bunch of little things. And in the back, I've got a survival kit by Bear Gillis, just a whole little kit there slid in the back that has like fishing hooks and all different kinds of things. So, and, and here's a quick look at the top. Uh, I mentioned this flashlight earlier. See, I've got a uh, little CR123 uh, flashlight on the top there. Uh, that's waterproof. So just a, a quick little look at the kit. Let me know what you carry in your EDC kit. Do you keep a kit like this in the car or nearby or handy when you're traveling or whatever? And, uh, of course, traveling, kind of difficult with the knives and so forth these days. But let me know what you carry and on your person or in a kit. And please subscribe. Thanks for watching.